Oh my gosh, good morning. <laughs> We're doing this thing here. We're heading into Disneyland. We're going into Disneyland. Hey, you know what we should do? We should go into Disneyland. Yeah. And look at that tree right there. That is a Disneyland tree. And this is the Main Street USA station for the Disneyland Railroad. Okay, this is cool. Wow, we're in Disneyland. <gasps> the castle. <laughs> it is a tiny castle, but wow. Look at that. Let's get a little bit of these sights and sounds. Good morning, welcome to Disneyland. This is our first time, first time here. So this is gonna be a little bit of our experience as we kind of go through here. And obviously, because we're very much Disney World people that live in Disney World, basically, we're gonna be comparing a lot of what we see to Disney World, which I think is kind of fun and interesting. And what kind of drew us here in the first place was wanting to look at things that are the same, but different. Oh, wow, look, a Penny Arcade. We used to have one of those in Disney World. We don't anymore, but that's pretty neat. Look at that castle down there at the end of the street. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, the Main Street USA, it doesn't feel smaller. We thought a lot of things were gonna feel smaller. Obviously the castle down there is smaller, but we thought maybe Main Street would feel smaller, but it does not. It feels just as big, if not bigger. Another neat thing is the trees. The, the trees are so mature here. Even though like Disney World's been around uh, plenty of time to have mature trees, but these trees just have something different to them. Maybe it's because we're in California. I don't know. It's just different than Florida trees, but oh my gosh, look at Matterhorn Mountain. That is neat. That is really neat to see that. That's really cool. Oh man, we did it. We are here. Oh, somebody's proposing over there. That's really fun. Congratulations. Oh, magic happens everywhere over here. This is super cool. So anyways, look at this castle, man. It's really beautiful, but it's really small. But man, this is the one. This is the original. Oh, look at the gold on there. And those spires. Yeah, look at that detail in there. That is cool. There's another view from the old side here. How neat is that? Oh, look. This is fun here. Look at Snow White up top there. What a beautiful place. Oh, and there's like goldfish inside of there. I wonder if they're supposed to do something. Oh, look at this. This is weird. How weird is this? This, this I don't know what this is. Yeah, I don't know what this is, but it's like there's some blue bubbling water. It's very strange. Do you know what this is? Interesting. But anyways, we're gonna head over to Space Mountain because we were gonna do the Matterhorn first. We actually got a lightning lane thing for it, but uh, it went down before we got to it. So we decided to try all Space Mountain out. Look at this thing. Is this the Astro Orbiter? Yeah. Here? Oh, it's not even on top of a building. Okay. In we go. All right, we're gonna walk in to the queue here. Gonna show a little bit of that action because I don't, I don't know. I'd like to see what this is all about. And maybe you do too. I don't know which way to go. Oh, this way I guess. Oh, wow. Whoa. Wow. We're coming right into a giant spaceship. Oh man, look at that. How cool is that? Okay, I'm excited. I just got real excited. That was different. Yeah, that was great. I really like 
that way better than the Disney World one. Yeah, I, I don't know. I like them both. Yeah. But this was things, cool. But that was, I like that. Autopia. Yeah. That's what we're going to do now. Or as some people call it, Autotopia. Autotopia. Yeah, this seems like a really neat classic thing to do. And these car designs are super neat. Like, they're different and they're futuristic, but classic. I, I dig it. Oh. All right, so we're doing this Autopia thing. It's pretty neat, like a little cruise through the country. Oh, look at that guy. There's a little robot guy. This Nice relaxing ride. You see, definitely relaxing. Whoa. Yep. Yep. Oh. Okay. Oh, look at that. Oh, little camper. That's neat. Oh, oh boy. Oh, wow. It's really low. Oh, man. I think that's the. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I got it. It's good. This is a. Oh, gosh. Oh, all right. Got it. Got it. Got it. It's away from you a little bit. You gotta reel it back in. Oh, we're back, going back underneath. Oh, we're going under the thing here. All right. Woo! <laughs> All right. That was pretty fun. Oh, we're like going off-roading. Oh gosh. Oh, I didn't know this was gonna happen. This is. Whoa, this is cool. Oh yeah. I like this a lot. <laughs> Oh, we're going back underneath the uh, monorail bridge here. I can't believe how low this is. Wow, that'd be super cool if the monorail went by right now. Awesome. Oh, and look at the water. Oh, a submarine. Wow. Whoa, jeez. All right, so those first two rides were really fun, but we've uh, worked up an appetite. Going to eat over here at ooh, Carnation Cafe, where JR is gonna get this breakfast skillet action. Me and Jessica, we're gonna share Walt's famous chili on top of an omelet. I think it's just called a ch chili cheese omelet. We couldn't be without Mickey waffles, so of course we had to get some Mickey waffles. Okay, we're gonna eat. We just stepped into this store over here, but up top they got these amazing like dolls or whatever. You got Mary Poppins, Bert, you got Snow White, Robin Hood. This is really neat. Ooh, and I can't forget uh, that food that we had at Carnation Cafe was fan flipping tastic. So we're gonna ride the, the railroad, but first, Matterhorn Mountain. Man, I, I like all the sounds of the, uh, like the wind blasting over the mountains here. Man, just gotta say, what a beautiful day. Oh, this place is great. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Whoa! 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 Remain seated with your seatbelt fastened. What wow. I said, oh, Yeah, that's not the smoothest ride. Maybe it's time to slow things down a little bit, take a little nice relaxing ride on the Disneyland Railroad.
Wow, what a neat surprise. Check out these awesome dioramas, scenes, whatever you want to call it. Got all these animals in here. These animatronic animals, which is amazing. I love that. Gives me some serious, like, old school universe of energy vibes. Especially at the end here, they got some dinosaurs. That's cool. Just stepped into Toontown. This place feels neat. Wow, all the things here. Where are we going? Roger Rabbit? Are we doing that? All right, I take it back. We're gonna do Indiana Jones now because the Roger Rabbit ride broke down as soon as we stepped in. Here in your transportation devices are ingenious pouches for safekeeping all earthly treasures when the journey becomes popular. Anyways, uh, this New Orleans Square place is really cool. Stopped in here just to kind of look at some more trees. On our way over to Thunder Mountain. Get ready for, you know the drill. scene that they have here and this one we don't have that one back home but ours actually through this little tunnel last portion piece it kind of rocks a little bit but wow this is this is a great ride love this love this now for a quick stop in uh, star wars ogre's cantina to wet our whistle and for some reason i just had to stop at this Hungry Bear restaurant. And look at this. They had our favorite food. Beige. So it's time to go nowhere in particular. I'm Mr. Toad's wild ride. Hey, let's go. Ooh. Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. I have not ridden that since I was just a, a little tiny little toddler. One funny thing is uh, when I was a little kid or whatever, I was riding that ride with my grandpa uh, in Walt Disney World. At some point in the ride it stopped and I got scared and I like instantly almost jumped out of the car. My grandpa had to grab me and put me back in the seat because I got so scared. But yeah, it's just one of those memories that uh, I enjoy <laughs> thinking about.
Wow, this place is so neat. But now it's time to eat. We decided to uh, walk ourselves from Fantasyland over through Frontierland, back over to New Orleans Square for the classic Blue Bayou restaurant. The, the restaurant that has the uh, Pirates of the Caribbean boats going in the background uh, right by where you eat. So that's pretty cool. Wow, look at that boat. Look at that, that's the Mark Twain. I love these paddle boats. Super cool. We're gonna start off with some of these corn dog things. These are corn dog nugget things. Uh, me and Jessica, we shared our meal. Um, it's called a Mardi Gras celebration, so you get an appetizer, an entree, and a dessert. Um, and we've got a couple of hurricanes here to wash everything down. Jessica's gonna cut into this corn dog nugget thing. Oh yeah, so it's it's pretty greasy there. And oh, it's andouille, that's right. These are not just regular corn dogs, they're andouille corn dogs. So, you know, it's got that kind of New Orleans-y flair. It smells delicious. So on the entree, the one that we picked, it's a surf and turf, right? So you get steak, you get shrimp, and you get these, uh, these fancy fries. If it's on the menu, JR is going to get the prime rib. It's kind of hard to see, it's pretty dark in there. It did look delicious and he tore it up. So the steak was cooked a little bit more than what we typically like, but it was still very good. The, the flavor was excellent. Really enjoyed it. And the dessert that we got was this Mardi Gras cake. It's like a cherry cheesecake type of thing. It was very good, I'll say that. It's got this neat little uh, wrap around it. It's like a white chocolate like wrap thing. It was ultra rich. Very happy that we shared everything. Wow, what a fantastically magical day that we've had today. If you've made it this far in the video, you are a champion. And thank you for watching and enjoying and hopefully enjoyed it. Get ready for more Disneyland content and all the other kind of content that we do. But uh, this little group, it's going to be uh, some Disneyland stuff. Hopefully you enjoy it as much as we enjoyed being there, doing it, and making it for you. See ya.